Mark Wright, 35, took part in Strictly Come Dancing back in 2014 and was paired up with professional dancer Karen Hauer, 40. The pair impressed both the judges and the public and managed to dance their way into the final. Following memorable routines including a cha-cha to Wham's I'm Your Man and a show dance to Queen's Don't Stop Me Now, they finished in fourth place behind Caroline Flack, Frankie Bridge, and Simon Webb. As preparation for the upcoming series gets well underway, Mark shared some insight about his time on the show in an exclusive interview with Express. Co.uk when asked whether he had any advice for the new celebrity contestants, Mark exclaimed, Good luck, because it is tough. Just put the work in, do as many hours as you can because when it comes to Saturday night, the nerves are just ruthless. And if you forget your steps, you think it's the worst feeling in the world. So just put the work in because you only get this opportunity once and you don't want to waste it. He also confirmed that he has remained in contact with Karen since their time on the show. However, he notes that they don't get to chat all the time because they are both busy. This year's partnerships are yet to be confirmed, but Mark had some very clear advice for whoever ends up with the Latin champion. He laughed, don't pee her off, before adding, no, Karen is great. Whoever gets Karen is going to be very lucky because she is brilliant, she's a great coach. This year's contestants include presenter Helen Skelton, Kim Marsh, X Factor's Fleuriste and pop star Matt Goss. In a previous interview with Express, Co.uk, Matt explained that he is nervous to take part in the show, even after performing on stage for decades. He told me, I have definitely got rhythm, but it is the learning, training and physicality. Everyone who has done it said they had a wonderful time, which definitely puts my nerves at rest a little bit because I am nervous. When Matt's comments were put to Mark, the former TOWIE star quipped that he hasn't seen nothing yet. He remarked, you wait until he actually gets there and on Saturday night, the nerves are just incredibly big. That was how I felt anyway. Nevertheless, Mark's time on Strictly didn't curb his love of fitness and he is now embarking on a new challenge. The reality star is running the London Marathon in October, a year after he had to pull out due to a painful calf injury. As he takes on the 26-mile run, Mark is fronting Flora's Get Town's active campaign to encourage others to be more active.